I'm actually staying at my dad's at the moment, um, and he's a, he's got super fast broadband, and the speed of it is, is amazing. I've never used it before because I usually have super slow broadband. But anyway, this video is going to be about how to clarify a video I did the other day, which was PHP Forms and Bootstrap Studio. Okay, and a few of you seem to be having a problem that using this form, it's not going to your email address and I have discussed it on here, but I mustn't have made it too clear. Anyway, so what's what's been happening is that when you go on my page, because I put this up, MB Designs, the contact form index um, HTML. And when you, if you if you say the send message there, right, nothing will happen um, because it stops you with the new entry sign. Okay, so when when you do right, and you put this in. And I know that a lot of you have been using it because I've been getting the emails for this. Okay, so just, um, you know, just going through this. And the phone, whatever. Da, 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 da. And your messages are just something like this. Right, this will send, okay. Right, contact form successfully submitted. Thank you, I will get back soon. And I think some of you have are having this idea that it's just going to magically go into your your email address well it doesn't it actually comes to mind because it's been set up so that um it comes it comes to mind okay so how we're going to change that as i said i did mention this in the video but i'll i'll try and clarify all this um when you you have to really do this online okay you can you can um you know do the css and stuff in bootstrap studio but you actually have to do the you know where where the um it's it's not going to work on your local server how it does on on your online. So anyway, what you're going to have to do is go and look for um, the contact form which is uh, here. So this has the drop down because this is what it's called the contact form. And on the h um, the index .html to this, what it does is has the login. Okay. So I'll show you this, right? Um, so here, if you can see that, where it's got form ID, method equals post, action equals contact PHP. This is basically just an HTML document. What it's saying is that the action is going to be taken by the contact PHP um, file. So if we come out of there, okay, and we go and find that um, contact PHP Right, just save and close. Okay. So now we're going to look for the contact PHP, which is this one here, right? Okay. Right. This is what what we're looking for. So this is uh, this is where it could get a bit scary. But as long as you've got a copy and paste it, and maybe just have a you know just do that, so you know that you've got a that file, and you can just put it back if it goes wrong. Okay. So there's it's not huge amounts of code in this but the bit that's really necessary to get it so that it goes into your email account and not mine so when when you do this this should go anybody that clicks on this form and sends it should go to your email address and not mine okay so this is the line here okay right where it says mail right so that's it there so this could say anything you want, whatever your email address is, this is what you've got to put in. And so I'll just put it into an editor, if this is the way you want to go. You could do this on the fly, or you could put it in an editor. And on mine, it's line 30, and it'll be about that for you as well. Okay, so this is line 30. Okay, and this is what you change, and you change it, and you do put speech marks in that. And some of you might not be doing that, and you just taking that without speech marks if you're doing that it'll not work so you just change if you've got an editor maybe or if you want to do it on the fly it's around line 30 um and you change it to wherever you want so if you want to you know your name is john smith just put that in if your email is john smith uh, at hotmail.co.uk you know you just do that and that's where that will go to 
I'm sure there's a lot of John Smiths at, hot, at hotmail.co.uk. So whatever your name is, you put that in, okay? With speech marks where the mail is, where that bit is there. It's so important because that's not going to go... That, at the moment, the way mine is set up, that's just going to go to me. But you will know whether that's working or not because you get the message uh, that the, the form is submitted. So what you want to do is find that form on your, on your, um, you know, your site and... Or, or if you're just trying it out just to see that it's working and put it and, and even put it onto this um you know put the comments on on this video that i'm doing here and some of us can go on that site so and, and send the phone to you and so that you know it's working so okay so i hope i've clarified that a little bit um you know it's I know working in PHP can be a daunting experience and all that from uh, from experience. So anyway, thanks for watching and thanks for listening.